This house backs up to City Park in Denver and it's a beautiful old historical home built in 1908 and I was very lucky to be able to work on this kitchen. It's always been a passion of mine to be able to work on historic homes and bring out the best features about them and save them, not just tear it all down. So I like to mix a bit of the modern and the transitional in with the old. So in this kitchen, we had the original butler's pantry and right here you can see there is a there was a wall that we removed and put a support beam up. There was also an electrical panel that we removed and brought it up to code and put it outside. Um, in this kitchen, we redid the floors, obviously to do some lace and patching in with the original floor, fur floors, which you don't see very many of those anymore. Um, there's cabinetry, we did all white cabinetry, the gray walls, very modern, beautiful look, a little bit darker on the doors. Used all the original hardware for the, the actual doors themselves. Um, and then we did a beautiful granite countertop, a Carrera marble beveled edge, subway tile backsplash, and we exposed some of the original brick and cleaned all of those off years and years of grime and plaster and all kinds of stuff. So we get a little dirty and we have a little fun and we make beautiful homes for people. So this is where the old wall used to be. This was a separate room on this side. This was more of the dining room. And we took that out to create a nice, more modern kitchen. Um, we did expose, the. we didn't close off the beam. I wanted to use that for part of the industrial look and we exposed the rivets. We did not hide them or recess them. Uh, we have the Carrera marble backsplash right here with the subway tile and the beveled edge. It's a beautiful finish. We have the granite countertops with the cute little bu bubbled hardware. Uh, we exposed the brick wall. You can see all of the original piping. We kept all of that. All of the windows are original. This table I found for my client. It was originally from India, and it's a work table. It's a regular height dining table that we had adjusted to make it a counter height island, like a work, a big, nice workspace. Then over here, we've got the buffet area. The back side of this is original to the home, and this was originally a solid wall with mirrors, and open that up for a pass-through. Put a nice granite countertop on it. We have cabinetry now that's been built in. It's very functional and provides a lot more counter space workspace for the homeowner.